Hi, my name is Amar. In this video, I will discuss how to use Date Picker in Flutter using GetX. Here, I have created this project Date Picker Flutter GetX by using the Get CLI tool. After creating the project in the pubspec.yml file, I have taken a dependency intl. This dependency will be used to format the date, right? And in the home controller, I have created a variable selected date. In this variable, I have stored the current date time by using date time dot now. And I have declared this variable reactive with the help of dot OBS. Now let me move to the home view part. In the home view part, you can see in the body, I have taken a center widget. And as a child of the center widget, I have taken a column widget. Now as a first children of the column widget, I have taken a text widget. In the text widget, I have used this date format. This date format I am getting from the INTL package. Here I have used in which format the date will be displayed, DD, MM, YYY. And which date will be formatted, the date which is stored inside the selected date variable of the home controller class. Okay. After that, I have used a text style having the font size as 25. And I have taken an elevated button. And as a child of the elevated button, I have used a text widget where select date has been written and you can see the corresponding output the current date is displayed this and we have a button selected now what i want is that whenever i will click on this selected button at that time the date picker will appear and to do that i will move to home controller in the home controller i will create a function choose date i will declare this function as async here i will use date time i will make it nullable i will give the variable name as pick date equals to await i will use so date picker fine in the context let me put up in the context here i will use get dot context in the initial date i will specify selected date dot value selected dot value in the first date here I will specify date time let it be 2000 and in last date I will write date time let it be 2024 fine now here I will write if pick date is not equals to null means if the user has selected the date and pick date sorry and pick date is not equals to selected dot of value then selected dot value equals to pick date now let me move to the home view file in the home view file in the on pressed i will call that method controller dot choose date now let me save this now if i click on this button then you can see that this date picker has appeared now from where let me select this date 20 okay and you can see the chosen date or the selected date has been displayed in this text widget right now I will discuss I will discuss some more properties of the date picker. Let me discuss one by one. Now, first of all, I will discuss initial entry mode. In the initial entry mode, here I will write date time picker. Date time picker. Sorry, it will be not date time picker. It will be date picker. Entry mode. Dot. It will be input okay now let me save this now if i click here then you can see the calendar is not displayed the input text is displayed where we can enter the date fine this is the functionality of this initial entry mode now i will discuss few more properties let me discuss one by one next i will discuss initial date picker mode initial date picker mode here i will write date picker date picker mode dot year okay now let me save this once again now if i click on this button then you can sorry 
let me save this now click here now you can see here that now instead of day calendar the years are displayed okay that is the functionality of initial date picker mode next suppose let me cancel it let me comment this let me save this once again now if i click here then you can see it is displayed now here you can see select date is written in the cancel cancel is displayed and for ok the ok button is displayed if you want to change this captions that is also possible how to do that let me discuss here i will use help text in help text let me write select dob that is date of birth in the cancel text means to change the cancel text here i can write in the cancel let me change it to close and for ok button we need to use confirm text in the confirm text let me write confirm save this now if i click here then you can see it is changed to select dob cancel has been changed to close and the ok button has been changed to confirm fine now if i click on this edit then input text box is displayed now here if i change this and click on confirm then you can see it is displayed enter date out of range now if you want to change this that is also possible this error message we can change how to do that to change that here i will use error format text and let me write here enter valid date and we have error invalid text here i will write enter valid date range fine now let me save this cancel it click here edit now let me delete this click on confirm then you can see here if i write here you can see this is enter date enter valid date this error format text is displayed enter valid date and if i write here then you can see if i writing 21 then this enter valid date range is displayed which i have written here fine now next we have filled label text let me change it to filled label text here i am writing dob now let me save this now if i click here once again click on this edit now you can see this date has been changed enter date has been changed to dob if you want to change this label then we need to use fill label text now if i remove this then you can see it is displayed mm slash dd slash this if you want to change this one then we have filled hint text here i can write month slash date slash year let me save this once again now if i click it click on this now if i remove this then you can see it is has been changed to month date year fine now i will discuss one more property that is selected day predicate okay here i will call a function display date which i will create and this is the function this one fine now here i will do one more thing i will comment this one now let me save this now if i click here then you can see it is possible to select the date from 18 to 23 means from the current date it is possible to select date within 5 days because for that here i have written this code disable date if day dot is after date time dot now dot subtract days 1 and day is before date time dot now dot add duration 5 days this means from the current date it will be able to select the date within 5 days that's why from 18 to 23 it is possible to select the date remaining dates we can't select okay that is the purpose of using this selectable day predicate fine 
आई होप यू हैव लाइक माई वीडियो इफ यू हैव लाइक माई वीडियो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग